when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answered a no, man, I still go. Go, 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 go. Hello guys, welcome back to yet another video. So Nothing is rolling out a new update for Nothing Phone 1 which is based on Android 13 and this is Open Beta 2. Nothing OS version is 1.5.1. So in this video, we'll show you guys some new changes what Nothing have done with this new update for Nothing Phone 1. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So here I have my Nothing Phone 1. Let me show you the software information by going to about section. And here you can see now the Nothing OS version is 1.5.1. Going to Android version. Android version is Android 13 and latest build comes with 5th Jan 2023 security patch. And guys, before moving ahead, if you like our content and think it's useful to you, then hit subscribe and smash that like button because it will motivate us to do better content with quality. We'll talk about the change logs. First, let me show you the themed icon is still not properly implemented on Nothing OS, which is based on Android 13. So if you see the wallpaper here, this doesn't consist of this orangish color. Instead of that, we have this red color, but you can see the themed icon color is completely different from the wallpaper what we are using. And this was the same case on initial build of Android 13. If you guys wish to install, then you need to be on nothing OS 1.5 and later download the incremental update file which is given in the description below. Till now we don't have the full zip file and you can only install it if you are running nothing OS 1.5. So I did download the file and after that what you have to do is you need to create a folder called OTA in the internal storage. I mean to say the root directory. The size of that file is somewhere around 121 MB. Once you place that file in the OTA folder, you need to open the dial pad and dial star hash star hash 682 hash star hash star. The system will automatically recognize the OTA update and you can just tap on proceed. The installation process might take around 5 to 10 minutes. And now let's talk about the change logs. So now nothing have introduced a brand new handcrafted glyph ringtones which can be found under glyph interface. So previously we only had 10 glyph lights but now if you go to default ringtones here you can see there's a new section called nothing machine 2. If you go here there are a lot of newly handcrafted glyph ringtones and notifications pack and you can choose them according to your requirements. You guys let us know in the comment section below which one is your favorite one from this new interface which nothing have added on nothing OS 1.5.1. After that, nothing also added few new wallpapers which can be found in the customization section. Going to wallpapers and style, tapping on change wallpapers, nothing section. Initially, I think we had only four wallpapers, but now another six wallpapers have been added from nothing team, which you can select from the wallpaper section itself. Later, nothing also adds few customizations for the lock screen shortcuts, which can be found in the settings, display, going to lock screen section and under lock screen shortcuts. Now you have options to choose between the shortcuts of button left and button right. These are the options which you can find it under button left. And here also we have the similar options which you guys can choose from. After that, you can easily switch between data usage when using dual SIM card. So here I don't have two SIM cards to test out but you guys can share the screenshot on a telegram group of nothing phone one link of that will be given in the description below. If you have any kind of questions related to this newer build you guys can join our group and ask us there. After that they say now smoother animation when transitioning the display between on and off regardless if always on display status. And yes guys the animations are now smoother compared to the previous build. Later they improved the auto brightness algorithm till now I did not find any noticeable change but I'll keep you guys posted in the in-depth review. And now Nothing have also added this Nothing X application. I mean to say they did integrate it inside the OS itself. With this update, Nothing also brings the pop-up menu. So if you are into the recent page, you can tap on this icon present here on the top side. And now you do get the option of pop-up view. Tapping on it, it will open the application in the pop-up view or you can call it as floating windows. And you can increase the size of this pop-up window just by tapping on it. But I do feel the animations are quite choppy here. But it's a good comeback and hope in future this thing gets improved with the upcoming builds. Then they did improve the camera app UI and animations. But here I wasn't able to see any noticeable change. If you guys feel 
there is a change then do let us know in the comment section below and last two change logs are related to battery life and increase the system stability also they did fix some known bugs so talking about the battery backup and charging speed along with the bug fixes i can only update you guys in the in-depth review so stay tuned for it if you have any kind of questions you guys can let us know in the comment section below we'll cover them in the in-depth review video so guys, this was the quick look on the changes done with Nothing OS 1.5.1 which is based on Android 13 and it's open beta 2. As of now, only this much in this video. I hope you guys gonna like the video. If you like the video, then do give us a thumbs up. And also if you're new to our channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. A lot, hustle every single day I'll be making moves till I'm buried in my grave uh, To the system, I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way uh, Or the highway